Hi everyone, this is the installation video for the Subaru Forester WRX and Legacy hood damper shock installation. This is what's in the box. You get the two shocks, you get the hood uh, hardware, and the car hardware to mount this with the installation paper. So the first thing we do is we find the uh, center fender bolt. Um, this will be a 10 millimeter metric, and we're going to pull that one out. Then we take the uh, hardware mount with the washer and finger tighten it first, just thread it in. And then use your socket. Make sure you don't over tighten it. You don't want to strip out the threads in your car. Just like that, nothing more. The second thing we do is remove the top bolt of your hood mount. This will be a 12 millimeter. Just remove the top bolt one at a time. Don't do these at the same time. Then we lay this down. Um, you get two brackets, and they have a sticker on the back. Uh, the driver's side is labeled with a D. The passenger side is labeled the P. We're going to take the passenger side for this. So you have the bracket. You take the bolt, put it through the bracket. Find your hole. Find the thread with your fingers first. Get it snug. Take the bracket and align it with your hood bracket in parallel so it's nice and flat. You don't want it to lay like this or like that. You want to make sure it's nice and flat before you tighten it. Take your wrench. Again, you do not want to over tighten this. That should be perfectly fine. Now it's all nice and parallel and straight. Last thing you do is you take the gas shock and you install it on the bottom of the car. It just clips right in. If you need to remove it, you can take a sharp piece of screwdriver or something, pull up on this tab and it'll pop off. You rotate the top piece, push up on your hood and clip it in and then you're done. And that's it. This is what it looks like when you're all done. As you can see, the the rod is a couple inches away. I, I made it to where you have a bit more uh, working spot with your hood. Um, this is what it looks like coming down. You just give it a little bit of pressure. And then it falls and you can close it. Or you pick it up and it opens. Um, and that's it.